it's Breland here and welcome to yet another real life review don't forget to subscribe to become an official glitter critter we're trying to reach 1 million glitter critters this video is about to get poopy I recently took a trip to Gulf Shores Alabama and I went to their local zoo it was called the Alabama Gulf Coast Zoo when I went there I found this Fun, natural gifts made from elephant poo-poo, made with real poo, poo-poo paper. So cute! <laughs> and of course, I had to purchase one and pick one of these babies up because, I mean, that's the kind of stuff you buy when you're on vacation and you're buying souvenirs, right? I decided that um, I not only wanted to review it with you, but I wanted to share it with some other people on this one app. Yes, another app. Y'all really enjoyed the last app that I talked about, so I decided that I wanted to share another app with you. And it is called Cinch. And let me just say, it's a cinch to download. This app is addicting. So basically, Cinch is an app where you can upload multiple photos and you can get people's opinions on them and people will vote on them. So let's say I'm having trouble posting a picture on Instagram. I want people's opinions on it. Like, should I use this filter or should I use that filter? So what you do is you go on Cinch and you post both photos and the entire Cinch community Cinchers will vote on which picture they like the best. That way you don't post a bad picture. It's actually a lot of fun and you can also just go through the entire cinch community and vote on other people's photos. It's definitely a lot easier than like texting your friends and saying, hey, which outfit should I wear? You could post photos of different outfits that you're thinking about wearing for school or something like that. So you could post a photo of this outfit and this outfit uploaded to cinch and you'll have cinchers vote on on which outfit they like best. And that's the outfit you can wear to school. Cinch is definitely a lot more different than most apps that I have downloaded in the past. And it's super cool because there's so many creative people on Cinch. So not only is Cinch completely addicting, but it's absolutely free. Like this is a free thing that here, have it. Here is your cinch. Oh, also, I'm going to be posting a cinch poll on this and a couple of other items. Make sure you go on my profile and vote on the poll as to which item is made of elephant dung. And it is super fun. You guys will totally be addicted within the first couple of minutes. I'll be sure to link it at the top of the description below along with my profile. Follow me, vote on my polls. I will try to follow you back. I really hope y'all enjoy it. So the reason I wanted to make this video is because I'm sure a lot of you out there have never heard of a product like this, but when I saw it, I I hadn't. So I have this little pamphlet here, and even the pamphlet is even made of elephant dung, and you can even see like the actual hay or grass that the elephant has eaten. So it says here on the pamphlet that Sri Lanka is home to about a tenth of the estimated global total of 40,000 Asian elephants in the wild. And they're not being killed in Sri Lanka for their tusks. Instead, elephants are being killed simply because they interfere with agriculture. So basically what the elephants are doing, they're getting in the farmer's gardens, the farmers are getting really PO'd, and they are shooting and killing the elephants or they're just killing them. It's not nice to kill elephants. I mean, I know they're really annoying and stuff, but to kill such an amazing creature, it ain't cool, okay? So basically what they did was they decided to show the farmers that elephants can be used to make this really awesome paper and it's actually sort of the texture of construction paper it's super cool and it's also a great way to help save elephants and be like yo Stop killing elephants, you can use their poo. So it says here, since an elephant's diet is all vegetarian, the waste produced is basically raw cellulose. Thoroughly, cl thoroughly cleaned and processed, the cellulose is converted into a uniquely beautiful textured product. This acid-free, linen-like, papyrus type paper can be formed into art and construction projects, notebooks, cards, and assorted gift items. Okay, so now that we know the cause and the reason that people are using elephant poop for paper, let's actually get into the texture, the feel, the smell of this paper. 
Okay, so as you can see, the elephant paper, it dyes really well. So they dyed this part black. Look at this beautiful rhino and this gorgeous sunset that they created with this paper. I mean, this paper actually absorbs paint really well. It's like a canvas type paper. And it looks like they cut some of it out and then glued it because it's got like a texture to it. It's raised. You can see like little pieces of grass that the elephant has eaten. So you can really see like all the different elephant poop, fecal matter. I see like tons of dust coming out of this. I really hope that's not poop particles because I'm breathing it right now. <laughs> so here is a close up of the white paper. Here is the green paper, by the way. This is what it looks like. There's orange, white, and green paper in this. And then this is the orange paper. And if you look really closely, you can really see all the poop and the grass that the elephant had pooped and eat and pooped out. Each page has a different poopy pattern. Okay, so I was going through the book on this green piece. <laughs> The poop fell off the paper. So I'm gonna write on it with just a regular black Sharpie just to see how well it writes. It's really not that easy to write on because of all the little bumps <laughs> from the poop. It's absorbing pretty good. So I love my glitter critters. It, it took to paper really well. Here's the back of the paper. It absolutely does not bleed through because this paper, look at that. It is super duper thick. Let's see what it looks like when you tear it. This is what it looks like when you tear it. Let's see, can you see any poop in there? So that is all for this real life review. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Also, don't forget to go download Cinch. Follow me, I'll try to follow you back. So that's all for this video. I thank you so much for watching and have a glitterful day. I love you, bye. Mwah!